Ransomware attacks, data loss, and other malicious actions prey on all businesses. The need for a fast, economical, air gap data protection solution is a requirement no matter the size of your business. More and more small and medium businesses are encountering data storage and security challenges that used to only be found in large enterprises. Let me show you how HPE can help. The HPE Storage MSL 1.8 Autoloader is a cost-efficient, entry-level tape automation solution specifically designed for small and medium businesses. It combines simplified media management with an air-gapped LTO media solution. It's a great starter tape solution that addresses backup resiliency with maximum security. In this video, we're going to talk about the third generation of the autoloader and highlight some of the new features and benefits. So the autoloader is a 1U autoloader, uh, moving it from a, a, a single tape drive with a single tape to a single tape drive managing multiple tapes. It's anything from an LTO7 to an LTO9 currently. Uh, it, the, the unit itself ships without a drive. Installation is about that easy. Uh, this unit itself is not scalable. It won't, uh, it can't go past those eight tapes, or at least those, those eight bays. Uh, we have other products like the 3040 and the 6480 that you can add additional modules to add more and more uh, tapes. Uh, the nice thing is, is that drive will work in a 3040, it'll work in a 6480. When you buy a, an auto loader with a single tape, you're making an investment that can help move forward. So we'll turn to the front here to show uh, the magazines with the tapes inside. So again, the Autoloader 1.8, one, one drive, eight tapes. Uh, the magazine itself holds four on each side. Those are LTO 8 tapes that are in there. You can see that are green. Uh, the orange tape is a cleaning tape. Um, cleaning can happen automatically. You can also put the cleaning tape in as it needs to to be cleaned. So you can have either seven or eight active tapes. Uh, but, it, you know, when you talk about the size of what you can put in this one U of space, these are LTO-8. Uh, LTO-8, this, eight tapes in this device would be 96 terabytes native and 240 terabytes compressed. If I moved up to LTO-9, I'm talking about 144 terabytes native and 360 terabytes compressed. It's a lot of, it's a lot of data and a lot of, of either backup or archive in a very small space. Okay, so regarding the rest of the front panel, I have a power button, I have LEDs that show if, I need, if it needs attention, if there's an error, if I've got, if it's cleaning. And then additionally, I have the OCP, the operator control panel, the LED, the LCD that's up here. It allows me to configure the device from the front panel, configure networking, do maintenance, run an inventory, do tests, uh, it allows me to, to do anything that I need to, to set the device up and to do some basic maintenance and configuration. So now let's jump back to the back. So I have a, a couple of fans for, for cooling. I have the drive itself. Remember that can be either SAS or fiber channel. I have a network port for the drive itself uh, for, for management. Remember that the connection is going to come through either the fiber channel or the SAS. And then the autoloader itself, I have a USB port, and that USB port uses uh, is there for our encryption solution. Our encryption solution is kind of unique. It's uh, we're the only ones that do it. It's a it's the a, the storage MSL tape library encryption kit. It's a fully self-contained encryption system. Uh, it can be deployed without any additional servers, any appliances. All you need are the USB sticks. That being said, don't lose the USB sticks. But it's a lot less expensive than like a KMIP solution and a lot less complex. Now, of course, we still support KMS and KMIP uh, came solutions uh, at standards, but this is a really handy way, especially when you're talking about something that maybe is a little more entry level. Uh, in the G3, we've moved to a, a gigabit NIC, um, and then that's important again for management and that sort of thing, but that's really important when it comes to the RMI. Now the RMI is the Remote Management Interface. That's the interface on the G3 and on all of our products that allows you to communicate with the autoloader or library from anywhere on your network. You can 
do any type of configuration, you can do any type of installation uh, when it comes to certificates, when it comes to additional software. One new difference on our RMI on this product is we've integrated uh, MFA, multi-factor authentication. Um, when you connect with the RMI, it gives you a QR code, you scan the QR code with your Microsoft Authenticator or with your uh, Google Authenticator and then you add that in with your username and password to get in. Just another level of security. Um, the other thing that the RMI helps you do when you set that up in the network connection is be able to use Command View. Uh, Command View for tape libraries, or CVTL. That's our software to manage multiple libraries and multiple auto loaders across your network, all from a single pane of glass. HPA's LTO tape automation provides long-term archiving, encryption, and air gap data protection against cyber attacks. With HPE and LTO, you can operate smarter, increase your security, all while reducing the total cost of your long-term data storage.